Hello everybody, I'm Dr. Mufazal Lakhtawala. I am the chairman of the Institute of Minimal Access and uh, Surgical Sciences at Sefi Hospital at Chani Road, as well as the director of the Digestive Health Institute at Kamala Mills, uh, Mumbai. We have only one simple index, that is of BMI. So it's never about your weight, but body mass index, which is your height, uh, weight in kgs divided by height in meters square. Now, if your BMI is between 18 to 23.5, you are Indian and Asian, then you are in the normal weight category. If it's anything above 23.5, up to 27.5, you are in the overweight category. Anything above 27.5 uh, BMI goes into the obese category. Then there are different gradations, all right? So 27.5 to 32.5 is grade one obesity. Grade two obesity is between 32.5 to 37.5. And grade three obesity or morbid obesity comes above 37.5 BMI. Now, if your BMI is above 50, you're called super obese. And if it's above 60, you're called super, super obese. Then they stopped adding the supers after that, all right? So anything above 60, even it could be 100 BMI. Uh, now, uh, they say that uh, WHO, the World Health Organization, also has come out with a different index, wherein they say that your waist, all right, or your waist hip ratio. So uh, if you're female in India, and your waist is more than 88 centimeters, or if you're male and your waist is more than 92 centimeters, then they say that you're a very high risk, moderate risk of uh, heart disease or hypertension. So you could use that in dice as well. Uh, body fatness uh, percentages in terms of fat percentage, in terms of muscle mass, these are very difficult to calculate and so we don't define obesity as uh, from those parameters. Obesity is a multifactorial disease and there are multiple causes. We yet don't know what is the one single cause of obesity. Most of the times when we see someone who's uh, a little on the heavier side, we invariably stigmatize that patient and think that that patient's eating a lot more food. Uh, that's quite incorrect actually to begin with. So obesity can be linked with genes. So uh, a lot, uh, if you have obesity from childhood, it could be your genes which are responsible. Uh, in adolescent obesity or once you are above 12 to 13 years of age, it could be your hormones which could lead to obesity. All right. uh, but averagely 90% of all causes of obesity is lifestyle related. Uh, wherein your intake doesn't match out with your output. So lesser exercise, more intake doesn't match and your body's metabolism. If you have a weak, weaker metabolism, there's always that higher chance that you will become uh, heavier. You will see someone who eats much, much more amongst your friends, amongst your, uh, your family members, but it's not as big as you are. And that you quite often wonder that why do people think that only you eat more than the other person. That just proves to you it's not as simple as more intake and less output causes obesity. <laughs>